Hi guys, it's me, Danielle, again. I do. I know I did a, a um, nail makeup tutorial, I think two days ago or yesterday, I'm not sure. But I'm going to um, go through all my, my MAC um, cosmetic um, makeup with you so you can see what I have. Um, I might tend to pick up uh, the makeup too. I'm not sure, but we're working on that today. And I'll show you guys other makeup that that I have another time. So let's get started. Um, first I'm going to show you my, um, my, my um, skincare product on MAC. I'm going to, um, let's see, I think it's called MAC Studio Moisturizer Cream. Um, every gal knows that before you put makeup on, you, um, you have to moisturize your face. And I always moisturize uh, my face before I put up, I put makeup on, and there it is. It's a really good um cream. It um it um gets rid of wrinkles on your face, which I have none, but still, um it also gets rid of eye wrinkles too. And it goes on so smoothly, you have no glue and everything. So I highly recommend you get this. And I have a new makeup look today. A wing eyeliner makeup look. Now, I'm, I'm going to go on with powder. I have from Studio Max 6 Plus today. Um... This is in NC3030, and uh, this, is, uh, this is a Studio Max, Max 6 Plus. You, you put this all over your face before you put foundation or after. If you put it on after you put foundation on you, it um, gets, gets, it sets your makeup. It, your makeup does not move all day and um and um it gets rid of the creases and all it gets rid of the creases i don't know if you, you guys can see that but but <laughs> there we go now i have um a uh, minimal skin finish um, powder by MAC. This is a high lighting powder. Um, you you put this on your um, cheek, on your um, cheekbone for a highlight. I have it on on today. If you can see that, like all up here, I have it on. And uh, this is called Soft and Gentle, by the way. That is. It's it's some soft and gentle, a uh, really nice high 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 hydrated um um powder. Now I'm gonna go on with concealer. I have concealer in N N N C twenty by Mac. Um, you put it all underneath your eyes. I have it on today, and um, th this is a studio finish concealer. Most people say that um, you put this on when you're doing photography makeup, and because uh, this is very thick concealer. I put it under my eyes because I I just put one coat and that's it, and I had the skin. If you buy this concealer, it's supposed to be for film and uh, photography. I have another concealer. Um, where is it? Here it is. 
This is a uh, MAC um, Faux Longwear Concealer. This is um, way different underneath your eyes. And this also, but I recommend this to put underneath your eyes because this, if this is thinner than this. But if you put this on, this um, the Studio Finish Concealer in SPF 35, they have a lot of other colors. But if you just put the, this on, make sure you put one coat and that's it. But I but I recommend this mask for long Oh, um, this I got, sorry, I had to go on my phone. <laughs> um, this is Black Track by MAC that I have. And if, if this is so black, you have no clue. It, 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 it glides onto your skin. Like, forget about it. And, um... I am used to um, have a gel, a um, liquid eyeliner, sorry, a liquid eye eyeliner be uh, before a gel. And let me tell you something. I like I like liquid eyeliners, but liquid eyeliners for me personally, no insult to anybody out there, but liquid eyeliners for me don't work good on me because number one, if you make a mistake, they go everywhere. It, the black goes everywhere, and it takes a little while to dry, and sometimes you don't have at the time. You, you just want to make a line and just go out the door, well, like I do sometimes. I, I just make a line, and then I go straight out the door, and then that's it. Don't bother with eyeshadow or anything. But once I started using gel liner, I I loved it because it 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 didn't smear and it also didn't like um it also didn't I didn't have to wait a while for it to dry. So I highly recommend black. <laughs> okay. My eyeshadow. It broke on me. Soft brown. Soft brown. I have another one hidden in the closet somewhere. A closet somewhere. It hit pan, but but um yeah. Um this soft brown buffs out anything and everything. I use it to buff out everything in my crease. Everything. I highly re recommend for brown. So, now I'm going to go on to my palette. My MAC palette. My MAC palette. I got two, two missing right here. Obviously, I, I didn't finish them. Let's go through to the colors. This is called the Vanilla. I put it all over my eyelid and for my highlight and in a tear duct to make me wake up and it's good. Um, th this is called Club. Club is for a um, smoky eye. A, a very smoky eye. Um, uh, club, vanilla, um, carbon, black. You could put this on the out of the crease to, um, make it smoky. Um, plum dressing. It's a very, uh, purple plum. Very purple. Um, I don't remember the name. But this is a uh, very um, pink color, very bright pink, even though it doesn't look pink probably in the video. Uh, um, let's see. 
is this is a baby pink purple i i think this is called liquid uh philomon um i don't know what that is but uh, this is a sunny spot it it looks green but it's not green um wait a minute let me just fix my camera here because okay now you can see me better right all right <laughs> sorry about that um sunny spot sky blue and uh, this is texture i am um, used this for uh, my smoky eye and this i i don't know i forget so that's my custom palette now we'll go on to my other Mac, um, obviously, this is, um, this is, um, a oppressed pigment by Mac called Deeply Dashing. Look how pretty that is. Look how pretty that is. It um, has a little sparkle to it. It has a little sparkle to it. It's very pretty. Um, I'm wearing a white jacket. So. I also have a um, a um, two palette. Yeah, a two palette. I don't know the name, but they're very pretty colors, purple and, uh, and light blue. You can put the purple all over your lid and the, I mean the pink all over your lid and some purple up on the outer crease if you want to make it look more And another one I have by MAC is, um, is the two again, gray and blue. I know that was probably purple. But it's dark gray, like sky blue. You you put the gray all over the lid and then the purple on the outside to make it smoke. Okay. And I have this. My hair is on me. <laughs> I have this this four palette of Mac. This is black. I don't know the name. Sorry about it. Black, purple, pink, and pink. Very, 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 very good. Oh, hi. <laughs> I can see myself. <laughs> A little mirror here. Now, this is another eyeshadow I, I have in Swiss chocolate. It's a matting. I, I, I mean Maddie eyeshadow, not Maddie chocolate. And it's a very nice, nice chocolate color. Very nice chocolate color. Um, I also have by Mac a um a red brick, and it also and it's also a um, Maddie color. Very pretty. Almondy color. Almondy color. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. And this is called actually this this uh, this is our Mac. <laughs> this is I I told you I uh, would uh, pick up. Uh, the makeup. Uh, this is called Ma um, Maybelline. I just got it today in CVS. It's um, bold gold. It's a very pretty um, eye kind of gold color. Very pretty. To call to put all over the lid or a night out or something. Now Mac. This is a, a very pretty purple color. It's called um, a Blue Orbit. Very pretty. 
it's a extra dimension eyeshadow. It's a very pretty light purple. I know it looks dark on the camera, probably, but it's it's lighter in person. Oh, you can see it's lighter in person. So I got from Mac is this very very aqua blue color. It's a very very aqua blue. It's a very very pigmented, very pigmented. And that's it. So I know I have a lot of other makeup in here, but I just wanted to show you guys what I had from now on to now on to my blushes. This is not a MAC blush. The, this is a, a regular a blush by um, Century 21 called uh, Blush Subtle. It's a powder blush. It's a very nice pink ish blush. This is MAC Blunt. This is highly very, very dark. It's a, it's a matte color. It's very dark. I have it on me right now, but you can't um, see it. I don't know why. This is called uh, MAC by uh, uh, Century Scarlet by MAC. It's a very pretty pink. Very pretty pink. I don't know if you can see that. Um, this is, um, Pink Moon by MAC. It's a very pretty pinkish and sheer. I have a lot of makeup. And, um, I just got this today. It's, it's called the Peaches by MAC. It's a very sheer tone blush. It's a very sheer tone blush. It, it goes on sheer. It's very nice and it's for all skin types. Whether you are, you are, you have porcelain skin, fair skin, tan skin, dark skin. This can go on to any skin type ever. So if you want, you can go with peaches. Okay. Um, now on to my lipstick. I'm only doing MAC. Well, I guess I'll uh, do the whole thing. I don't know. I'll do my uh, drugstore first. I got, first of all, I love Maybelline uh, lipstick. They came out with such a cosmetic line that their lipsticks are killer. I love their lipstick, by the way. Um, I got one in, in a Fuchsia Flash. It's a very pretty pink. I don't know if you can see that, but it's a very pretty pink. Now, it's a, this is called um, Sparkling Sand. It doesn't have a, a um, color to it. It's just white. This one is um, Pink Sand. I always put this 
the charming. This one is a brazen berry. It's a purple color. Everybody in her makeup knows that this trend for the season in 2000, um, 2014 is um, like orange colors, white colors, purple colors, and stuff like that. So, um, so yeah, this is a very pretty purple color. Very pretty purple color. This is hot plum. This is um, not the purple color, but it's pink is purple. This is white vivid rose. It's a very pink color again. Um, <laughs> I love my Mac. As you can tell. Um, this is um, called Diva Lipstick. This is a very, very dark lipstick for the winter. I put it on in the summer too, but in the winter, it's Mac red, Mac red. I know I have to buy a new one. It's this Mac red is so popular. You have no clue. Um, remember how I told you that orange is in for the summer and the spring? Well, it's not on only clothes. It's makeup too. Um, but, uh, so. This is a very pretty uh, coral orange, very pretty coral orange, very, and this is called Saigon Summer. This is Flesh Pot. This is the Pearl Longwear um, Positively Dashing. Um, lipstick that I wear a lot of times because it's a pro home wear. You um, don't have to be just buying it and applying it. <laughs> um, it, it, this is the um, Milan Mode, which is melting. Ooh. And I'm gonna. And I have. Lip glosses. I have Mac Saint German. Saint German. I also have um, pink lemonade. So there you have it, guys. All my Mac products, and I'll come back with more tutorials on how to do spring-like makeup and um and um, more everything nail skin everything so i'll uh, see you guys soon um go post go to my ig which is dazzle me up makeup on facebook i also have a beauty blog called makeup artist danielle dot blogspot com and leave comments and i'll uh, see you gals soon bye